Hi there. Uh, I This is Dalton Cloud. So I know in our last video, we talked about possibly making a video where we go a little bit more in depth uh, for LinkedIn profile and creating that. Uh, we're going to have a little bit of a change of plans. In this video, we're going to be discussing motivation uh, for getting certifications, uh, why all these uh, content creators are so sick, so sick, I can't say that word successful uh maybe that's why i'm not uh, and um wh why they're doing this why why are they why are a lot of these content creators pushing uh uh motivation templates and motivation quotes over actually uh certification tips uh, uh but it's a very good reason on why uh but let's get into it Hey, welcome back. And also, I didn't mention this before, but please be sure to click that follow button and enjoy the rest of the video. Um, okay, so first thing you see uh, when we get up, this is a snippet from one of the first content creators, a uh, personal favorite of mine. His name is Brodus Palmer. So he actually started out uh, working at a company called Linux Academy. Uh, and this was actually probably one of the first videos I ever saw. What got me introduced to Linux Academy and ACloud Guru. Uh, this was a real motivation to me, this video. If you ever get a chance, I'm going to link it uh, down in the description below. Uh, this is a great motivation uh, video. It really is inspiring. Um, just goes a little bit in depth on how he got from having no experience with cloud to getting certified and getting in the field. Um, he actually has, uh, he still uh, works for uh, a cloud guru, but he also actually has his own uh, community similar to it pathways. Uh, it's called level up in tech where he has boot camps where he goes in depth with uh individuals um and in smaller class classes and he helps people get certified reach the goals they need to he has all these amazing inspirational um quotes inspirational videos he releases that really help people stay focused stay on track and really have the uh end goal in mind and that kind of brings us to why some of these content creators are, are creating this instead of uh, videos on how to get certified because uh, they're, they're creating labs, yes, and they are creating certification uh, courses, but there's already enough courses out there. But a lot of people are getting all these courses, uh, like all the content that's on Udemy, but they're not actually following through with this. They're not actually getting certified. You'll see that there will be over 20,000 purchases of, uh, for example, uh, Jason Dion. We'll, we'll, we'll just uh, name drop Jason um, since uh, he, he has a high influx of students taking courses, which is great and it's good for him and his team, but how many of those individuals are actually following through and getting certified is the issue. And it's not that he's not doing a great job presenting this content, but it's just that uh, he presents the content in a really easy to digest format, um, but individuals get so bogged down with everything and they don't know how to uh, manage their own time uh, and manage their own priorities in life, uh, or they lose track of what is a priority. And that is why they never get certified. Uh, I, I know uh, they're... they're uh, Speaking of Udemy, there, there's a whole selection I have of courses that are still untouched even, uh, if not completed. Uh, it could be a course that I purchased for someone else to utilize on my account, but um, regardless, it's it's still uh, not something to uh, brag home about. Um, and it's precisely people like the Brodus and a lot of these other content creators we're going to go over today 
uh, in, in how they help in their individual niche fields and help motivate people and help people along, uh, which is why we need more people like them in the fields. So there's also uh, this individual. He's uh, another person. He, he does go in depth a little bit more. Uh, not exact, exactly boot camps like Brodus does, but he does give uh, videos to help people understand uh, how to break into IT, uh, the advantages of going certification path instead of college path, um, uh, what are highly uh, paid uh, careers, uh, which I'm uh, just to mention, I, I also kind of this is great for his video and for the algorithm, but uh, uh, this is something I try to stick away from because any field in IT is going to pay you a decent amount. Even if you go help desk and you eventually make it the help desk manager, you could get you could start out as a help desk manager making forty five thousand. But uh, <laughs> doing something and not loving what you're doing is going to make the work so much harder. If you, if you go into a field and you actually enjoy it, even if it's not going to pay you the most, like let's say you want to be um, into, we talked about marketing here before, let's say a data analyst, but you know a data analyst isn't going to make you as much as a project manager or even as much as a security analyst or a security engineer, that's fine as long as you enjoy what you're doing. Uh, that's the most important part. Uh, or if you enjoy networking more, but you know security would pay you more. Hey, if you enjoy networking, stay in networking. You could even go networking and get a security specialty. Um, but I, I advise away from stuff like this. Um, but regardless, he does make a lot of other amazing content that does help people. And he does talk about a little bit more specifics in the networking scope, which is very helpful for people who follow his content. Um, this is a uh, up and coming. I'm very surprised he only has uh, 8,000 subscribers. Uh, he makes amazing content. Uh, he does stick to some of the more entry level uh, certifications. For example, he has a lot of uh, content for the Security Plus. Uh, which is how I actually got introduced to IT Master. Um, but he makes amazing content on uh, why you should get certified and what goes on with the certification path um, and uh, what certifications are worth getting, which ones aren't, what are the advantages and disadvantages to each certification uh, and what the outcome would be. So this this is definitely someone to follow. He does do some motivational stuff but he goes like like i have on previous videos he goes a little bit more in depth on how to get certified uh he even goes as far as to have practice questions uh that he goes over in reviews uh with people um so a little bit more similar to um professor messer um but great content creator here as well uh and at, at the end of the video, we're going to have links to all, all these uh, content creators channels uh, just because of the amazing stuff they do. Uh, all three of these individuals are amazing in their own respective fields. Bart Castle, more on the field of Amazon Web Services. Uh, great content creator, very funny. Uh, you could catch him in his hurt, although I think he's uh, upgraded uh, from a hurt. Uh, uh, into a larger environment by now. Uh, there's Jeremy uh, Siora. Uh, more specifically, he has a really big niche with uh, networking. Um, and uh, both these individuals work at CBT Nuggets along with our third motivational uh, speaker, Network Chuck. A lot of people know Network Chuck. I'm sure a lot of people who don't even uh, aren't even into IT uh, watch network Chuck just because he creates such amazing content it's so thrilling uh, I wish I had half the charisma that he did uh, completely uh, uh, I also wish I had half the beard he did <laughs> uh, I just can't can't stand uh, having it uh, that long <laughs> um, am amazing amazing content um, 
Both these individuals uh, are amazing instructors. Uh, Chuck is an amazing instructor and amazing content creator. Um, they're all amazing content creators, but Chuck just goes above and beyond. Uh, he's definitely someone you should check out. He always uh, has different um, labs, interactive labs with his live stream. He has giveaways. He's always trying to engage with the community around him. Um, he's also trying to engage with other instructors, uh, other content creators, get them involved. He helps content creators uh, or uh, and even just people in IT uh, make a name for themselves. And uh, I just feel like out of anyone who is the most engaging, uh, Chuck Chuck just brings the community together in such an amazing, uh, charismatic way. Uh, I, I I feel like uh, you should definitely check him out. Um, he'll he'll never know watch this video or know who I am, but definitely someone to check out. Um, from if if you want to like just get motivated, if you want to find cool little projects, he has a lot of amazing Raspberry Pi little projects he works on with people. Um, just get learn a new skill every day. Uh, he's someone who you should definitely check out. Again, uh, from the last video, Jeremy, uh, see where he he has um a uh, YouTube channel called Keeping IT Simple. Uh, he has a, amazing uh, ways for people to stay updated on how to stay motivated to study, like such as this video, um, what certifications to go after, um, five ways to stay relevant at your job, which we talked about before, which is don't get complacent. Uh, being relevant at your job is the same thing as staying uh, staying away from complacency. So this is definitely uh, someone to check out. Amazing content. He's reiterated a lot of stuff I have. Uh, he He's a lot more in-depth in networking than anything else, but still an amazing uh, content creator, an amazing person to uh, engage with and follow. Uh, next, David Bomble. Uh, David has helped, uh, speaking of Udemy from earlier, David Bommel has helped hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of people uh, and thousands of people uh, get certified in a various amount of different certification paths. He helped people uh, with networking, security. Uh, there, there's a lot that he helps people with. Um, he posts content daily uh, uh almost daily um he posts on his uh even on his linkedin and twitter he'll post uh helpful tips and uh, helpful uh questions to engage with people engage people's minds and get them thinking about networking uh, this is just an amazing person to watch because he's so, uh, and he, he helps people become inquisitive and that, and, uh, you know, trying to learn, uh, having your brain, uh, chug along like that and try to, uh, think about a question is, is also an, an amazing part of the study path. So he's, he's just in that regard. He's one of the better instructors, uh, because uh, he'll engage with everyone on social, um, but he'll also, as you see, he'll also, uh, like Chuck, he'll, he'll create little um, uh, lab scenarios that you could work along with him. So uh, kind of like a jack of all trades uh, with the content creation, uh, inspirational route. Um, very amazing person. And then uh, last, uh, this is someone who's up and comer. Again, someone who's with a cloud guru. Um, Gwen and, and she just got added to their content creation team. So she'll be making YouTube videos with them, uh, growing their YouTube channel out. Again, I'm not sponsored by a cloud guru. I just love their instructors. Um, currently, uh, for everyone, uh, while I'm studying for the network plus, I'm also studying for, Azure Fundamentals um, course that A Cloud Guru has. Uh, 
just so I could go over that with everyone, let them know how long it's going to take. Uh, generally, from what it looks like right now, it's going to take actually two weeks of studying, uh, one week for actually studying and one week for studying the practice exams, and then uh, we'll take it from there. Um, so just be aware that's probably going to be one of the videos coming out next. Um, but Gwyneth, uh, uh, Gwyneth, I'm not even going to try to say your last name, and I'm completely sorry. Um, she makes an amazing content, mainly in the uh, Microsoft Azure atmosphere. But she's very engaging with her audience. Um, she just does an amazing job uh, explaining her background and how she got into IT. Uh, she, she is very transparent with everything. So just an amazing uh, person to uh, engage with and uh, follow. Um, I highly suggest you uh, take a look at her channel as well. And again, we're going to have uh, all of these people um, uh, listed in the comment section at the end of the video. Um, but with all that being said, uh, th th there's a reason why uh, you want to follow people who aren't just um, aren't just uh, giving you tips for uh, or, or gi giving you certification material, but also people who want you to actually follow through with your commitment. It's kind of like the New Year's resolution. They don't want you to just say you're going to do something and then uh, you're still going to have your uh, certification book sitting in the corner with your dumbbells that you're never going to pick up again. Uh, you you, uh, you want to follow through with your New Year's resolution. Um, and, and that's what a lot of these content creators do is they help motivate people, uh, find their own path, and uh, actually follow through to get certified. And when when you're creating your own personal feed, for content which you ingest on YouTube, on Twitter, on LinkedIn, on whatever social media outlet you usually try to follow. Uh, these are the type of people you want to surround your feed with because these are the type of people who are going to help you get certified and get ahead. Um, uh, sorry about that cheesy quote from a book title. There's a book title on there somewhere. But um, other than that, Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Uh, this has been Dalton and Cloud, and this is another video on uh, motivation and uh, IT pathway and um, uh, personal uh, pathway in uh, the technology space. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video.